Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing another tier list and this tier list is on all of the legendary Pokemon in the games. I think it actually start, stops after Nintendo Switch, which is a bit strange. Uh, I think it's an old one. So I'm going to quickly go through the Nintendo Switch legendaries and then we'll get on to the the ones that are here. So, first off, we're just going to go off with uh, Sword and Shield. So, when it comes to Sword and Shield, we got Zamazenta, Zacian, and Eternatus. Um, we're going to go with, we're going to start off with Eternatus. I'll put Eternatus in pretty good. Um, and then when it comes to Zamazenta, I'll put in actually, okay, he's actually pretty decent Pokemon, defensively sound. And Zacian has to be amazing. It's like literally the strongest Pokemon when it comes to attack, especially. Like, fantastic Pokemon. Um, so that, that, that's what they would be. When it comes to Scarlet and Violet, um, I'm going to put the four brand new, like the four legendary, the four legendaries that you have to collect sword and stuff. I'm going to put in, didn't know they existed. Um, I did know they existed, but I don't know anything about them. I can't say they're terrible, actually, okay, pretty good. I know the cat looking one's really cool, so I'll put him in a good, uh, pretty good thing, Z Chow or whatever it is. It's the, the dark and ice one, I think it is. Um, and then when it comes to the two legendary Pokemon, of Coradon and Maradon, I'll put in okay. They're, they're decent. They're not really they're not really legendary Pokemon. They're all the new versions of Silazar. Don't agree with how they did it, but um, it, 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 we can't change it. So they're not in any particular order. So we're going to start off with just the top, and we're going to start off with God Himself. But before I do get into this, please make sure to like and subscribe. 98% of people who watch these videos aren't subscribed, so it really helps out. We're going to probably aim for about 5,000 by the end of the year. So it would be greatly appreciated if you can help out and you can unsubscribe anytime. And if you need another reason to subscribe, look at my likes. Like, it's fantastic. Um, but no, uh, when it comes to this as well, I'm not going to be basing it off like how good they are in competitive. I'm going to be basing it off and make sure they're designed, how good I think they are personally on a personal level. So if you disagree with me, let me know in the comments below. It's absolutely fine. I want to hear everyone's opinion. So let me know in the comments below. And let's start ranking these finally. So yeah, like, like I said, literal god Arceus has to go into amazing. He can change his type into anything. So I think even that just puts him in amazing. And I just even up just... He's just, he's just a good Pokemon, isn't he? The state stats are fantastic as well. Um, Articuno, uh, I think the three legendary bird Pokemon are okay. Um, so I'm going for the other three. I don't know. Oh, God. I think the three legendary Pokemon are just okay. I don't think they're anything too particularly special. Um, it's still good Pokemon. Like, you know, you're going to take them. It's, it's, it's Kanto. They're going to have the Nostalgia Factor as well. But I think just as legendary Pokemon, like, they, they are, they're okay. Um, so like I said, I'm gonna be doing this. In, I'm gonna be doing this a mixture of what I basically think about on the on the time. So like for example, I think this is Mesprit. It's one of the three. Uh, I think it's Mesprit. Um, I'm gonna put in. I don't know. They can always got different abilities and stuff. I'm gonna put Mesprit. I feel they they, they can't all stay in because the, they unlike the three legendary birds, they are they, they 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 don't have a gimmick, but these guys do. Uh, I'm gonna put it okay, only because um, like I don't think he's particularly fantastic, but I don't think they're terrible. But when it comes to Celebi, Celebi is gonna go in pretty good. Uh, the ability to go back in time, I think, just cements his spot in pretty good. Um, so I can't really change anything about that realistically. Um, but no, I think Celebi is pretty decent. But when you get Celebi, it's got a really nice shiny as well, the pink. Um, I quite like Celebi. Uh, Cabalion, I think this is. Um, ooh, I don't know. I'm gonna put in terrible. I don't remember getting any. It was a steel type, which kind of bumped kind of bump up to okay. But I don't remember hearing anything great about Cabalion. Um, so, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Cabalion can stay in terrible. I, I, even, I might be a terrible call. I don't even know. Um, Cosmic's Evolution. Cosmic Uh I know it's really heavy. I know that for a fact. I know it's meant to, ha it's meant to have like the same massive neutron star. Um, but it's like, it's a free stage evolution that evolves into, uh, the, the legendary Pokemon of, uh, Alola. So I'm going to put in, I think, I, I don't think, I think these two just aren't good. I think if you're going to use, you, you, you wait, they, they, they're there for the story, realistically. Um, I just, I just don't think they're that good. Um, oh, bollocks, what's your name? Dark Rite, anyways, Dark Rite is going to go into amazing. I really like Dark Rite. I love using Dark Rite. Story in the game is fantastic. Him just in general is fantastic as well. Um, everything about Dark Rite, he's so menacing. I don't remember your name. I don't remember your name, bro. Uh, I just remember you peeing. Actually, okay. I, I know I, I'm going to get some stick for not remembering name. 
Um, I know, I know, I you, 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 I know the story about it. It's, it's the only thing that can wake you up after dark. Right? I just the name's left in my head. Like, let me, <laughs> please, let me off. Um, Deoxys attack. I think all Deoxys has gonna go into pretty good because he can like, he can change his method of fighting. Like that, I think that his ability is just fantastic. Like you're coming up against defensive Pokemon, you're gonna get a bit, of, you know, a bit more attacking. You come up with a very, very good attacking Pokemon. You're gonna set up a bit more defensively, or slow, fast. You go fast. Yeah, it's quite. I think it's. I think it's a really good little gimmick. To be fair, Dialga, I think is gonna go into amazing. Roar of Time is a fantastic move, and I think Dragon Steel type is a fantastic combination as well. Um, so, and I think just especially in new ones as well, the newer games, they still even go even more stronger. So Dialga has to go in fantastic. Diancy and Diancy's evolution. I didn't I think that's a mega evolution. So I don't want to put it into didn't know it existed, but I think it's the only one with a mega evolution. If I'm correct. The only uh, the only like the only legendary with a mega evolution. So I'm not too sure to put that, uh, to be honest with you. Um I'm gonna put in didn't know they existed only because I don't know enough about the mega evolution. Um, to justify ranking it, but with Dancy, I'm pretty sure it's terrible. Um, so like I like I like the film. Like I know the Kakuna destruction. I like the film. Like I, you know, but I no. I, 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 no, I'm not too sure about Dancy. I'm gonna put it in terrible. Uh, I'm gonna get absolutely rinsed in the comments below. Um, but do you know what? I don't care. Entei, pretty okay. Um, decent fire type Pokemon, quite, got quite a good story, gets born every single time a volcano erupts and was part of the Burnt Tower. Uh, Genesect, um, I'm gonna put it okay. Genesect itself, his typing is quite poor. Um, and I think that, like, Bug Steel is a terrible typing because it's weak to fight, four times weak to fire. I'm pretty sure it's four times weak to fighting. So two four times weeks isn't good at all. But then ultimately Genesect, his design's quite cool. All right, really like Genesect's design, one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, I got him in Pokemon Go, got him in, uh, what else have I got him in? Got him in other games as well. Um, but I don't know, I'm not too sure about his typing. I know he's meant to be decent attacker though. Giratina, I think both forms have just to go up here. Like, they're really good Pokemon, you can't disagree. Um, they get the skill of Giratina, like, the story behind is fantastic, obviously. Being part of the creation, lot, um, creation trio. Like, I think, you know, being part of the, you know, Dialga, Palkia, Giratina, then getting out and bust, like, the, you know, abandoned to the lower levels of the distortion world. I think it's a fantastic little story behind it. Uh, and the Pokemon itself is really good anyways. Uh, Primal Groudon has to go into Amazing, but Normal Groudon's gonna go into... What are these two? It's pretty good. I'm pretty sure Groudon's pretty good. I haven't used him in a while. Um, but Primal Groudon, I know, was an absolute beast when it comes to competitive Pokemon, especially. I know, like, whenever I watch a competitive Pokemon, stream, it would just always have pri uh, Primal ground on, so I can't put him anywhere else just based on that sort of fact. Anyways, Heatran is terrible. Um, I never liked using Heatran. I've used him a few times, never enjoyed it. Um, he's going to have to go into terrible for me. Ho-Oh, I've got a massive soft spot for Ho-Oh. I'm going to have to put it in amazing. I just love Ho-Oh. Gen 2 is my favorite generation. I know that's like the weirdest thing to say, but I love Gen 2 just from Heart Gold Soul Silver. Fantastic games. I'm gonna have to, I've got to save them, I'm gonna have to play them. Um, fantastic games. I love the story behind Ho Ho as well. Um, I think it's just brilliant. I, I really like the fact that I just love its design. I got a few Ho Ho cards as well. Brilliant Pokemon. Hooper's, like, not evolution form, it's just his real form, I guess. I don't know. Uh, it's pre, pre evolution form is gonna go into terrible. I know this. Guy's meant to be fucking fantastic. Um, I don't know, I don't know if he, is he good enough for amazing though? I'm gonna put him into amazing only because if you look at uh, the Hooper film, like he can spawn legendaries and like he can spawn legendaries, he can control them. So I think just based off that, he has to go into amazing. Um, I know the film wasn't the best, I enjoyed it. I don't go into film, Pokemon films thinking it's gonna be a theoretical masterpiece. Um, I quite enjoyed it, so I don't, I, I don't know about, you know, I know it got very bad reviews. But I, 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 just based off that alone, if you could control, like, Rayquaza and stuff who's down here, like, you deserve to have, you deserve to be amazing. Uh, Jirachi, amazing, just, it's got the ability to make a wish, and I know you never actually technically see it making a wish, you just make stuff teleport to you, but if you have, if it's true, oh, it's not true, it's fiction, but if it's, like, in that world true that you, you can make a, 
What's it called? You can make a wish, wish and it can do anything, then it's the most overpowered thing, like, ever. So I think Jirachi has to go into Amazing just for that. There's not going to be... I might do, like, a final GOAT Pokemon. Um, but uh, I don't know, yeah. Depends if I remember at the end, to be honest with you. Keldeo? Keldeo's... Hmm. Keldeo's a good one. Keldeo's like, attack form I know his attack's really good, so I'm going to put him in pretty good. His normal form is going to go into one of these two. I'm not too sure which one just yet. I'm going to put him in... Okay. Uh, these aren't, like, ranked in order, so I don't think in the sense of, like, ho -Oh's, Like I don't think, for example, like, Groudon isn't as good as Celebi. Like, if realistically, Groudon would be over there. But it's just, I'm just going to put him in pretty good and leave him in pretty good. I'm not going to rank him in order in pretty good. Primal uh, Kyogre is just equally as good as Groudon, uh, Primal Groudon. Same for Kyogre. Uh, it's going to go into pretty good. Amazing for Primal. Like, once again, you always see him in competitive. Like, they are just really good Pokemon. You can't fault him at all. Um, when it comes to the Kyurem with Zekrom and Reshiram infused in them, um, I forgot what was that, I can't rush there, we yeah, they're down there. Um, I'm gonna put them both in pretty good. I love the story behind them. Like, obviously, with the fact that he, you collect his energy and, like, he just turns in, like, he turns into this next piece. It's from Black and White 2, some of the best Pokemon games ever. Um, Kyurem is gonna join them as well, because the story behind Kyurem is very, very entertaining as well. Um, when we, then we go on to the Weber Trio, and I think this is Landris in, on the top of my head. And I'm going to put, but I don't know the difference between the two. Um, I'm going to put them in okay, because I don't think they were terrible Pokemon. Um, I, don't, I, don't remember, I don't recall ever hearing anything that they were the worst Pokemon. I think they're pretty forgettable, um, which I think means they're pretty okay. Because if they're going to be terrible, then you're going to remember. Like, I've heard plenty of times Heatran's terrible. Um, so, like, I think it's just one of those things. Uh, Mega, Latios, and Latias. You ride on them for Mega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, which I think... That in itself, like they're, they're very useful. Uh, you don't really hear much story about La Mega Latios and Latias, but I think for the fact that they're Megas, you can just put them in pretty good. And I'm gonna put the two, the Latios and Latias in pretty good as well. I love the story, the film, fantastic. I'm actually going to Venice soon. Um, and I'm pretty sure it's like, not where it's based, but it's like, it's definitely where it's like imagined up. So I'll be watching that film on the plane to Venice. You can guarantee that. Um, I love, absolutely, I do like these two Pokemon. Uh, Lugia as we go into amazing like the fact they can control uh, the free Pokemon down here I think any Pokemon that can control Pokemon has to be amazing it can control Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres if they're fighting then he can just stop it in the film fantastic and a really good Pokemon in general to be fair to Lugia um Lutana it's from Sun and Moon and I've, like if you watch this channel for a little bit you'll understand that's my hatred the Sun and Moon is it, it's it's different. I can't stand those games. I need to, I need to play Ultra Sun Ultra Moon. I do need to play it and then I'll play it one day. I've said for like the last year. Um, but I don't want to say they're terrible because I don't know about, enough about them. I'm gonna put them in pretty okay. I'm gonna put the the Lion one as well in pretty okay. I'm pretty sure I think Solio. I think his name is it's meant to be better. Um, and then we've got it's not Diancy. Um, then we've got, I can't remember your name, uh, I don't know much about you, I know obviously you're not pretty good though, if I'm wrong on that one, I'm going to get killed, I will get killed for that, Manaphy, okay, pretty decent, I like the story behind Manaphy, um, is it okay, is it okay, uh, I don't know, I don't know, is it okay, I'm putting him terrible just because we need, like, okay, so on the second tier, uh, Marshadow, I'm pretty sure Marshadow's pretty good. I haven't used Marshadow, I'm, I don't know, I can't remember if it's Gen, Gen, uh, Gen 7 or Gen 8, no, no, Gen 7, yeah, or Gen 8. Um, but I have heard this meant to be pretty decent, so I could be hearing this off the wrong person. Uh, Meloetta and its other form, like, no, like, it can control people when it sings, that's what it was. It controls people's emotions when it sings. That's what singing basically does. Like, if I'm listening to a happy song, you're going to be a bit more happy. If I'm listening to a sad song, you're going to be in your feels and a little bit more sad. Like, it's what singing does anyways. I think it's just, it's just, a, like, just a stupid thing. Um, like, you can stay there. Uh, don't worry. Didn't know they existed. We'll be full in a second. Don't you Don't you worry. Uh, Mesprit. 
Oh, I've already done mess for it. That's mess for it. That's mess for it. That's. So that's mess for it. That's we got Uxi somewhere. Uxi Uxi's down here. Um. Yeah, the other one. Uh, Mesprit, I think, can join. I think Yuxi can join in, actually, okay? I know together, like, they help create the red band, and I think if for that, they could even go on pretty good, but then it didn't actually control Dialga, so it actually didn't work, so I'm gonna keep him in okay. We're gonna keep him in okay. Mew. Fact, amazing. Mew has the ability to change into any Pokemon. I saw a clip, literally, like, half an hour before recording this, of it changing into two Pokemon at the same time, Kyogre and Groudon. From, I think it was uh, one of the newer ones, I think the Galar anime, and like it started fighting itself, and I just didn't understand. But uh, it, it can change in the Pokemon. It has the DNA of every single Pokemon. Um, you can't not go for amazing for Mew. And when it comes to Mewtwo, has to join Mew. Like it's meant to be the stronger Mew, but I think Mew's stronger. But Mewtwo, we all know, is absolutely fantastic. And when it comes to Mega Evolutions, I'm gonna go for amazing for I think that's X, and I go Y for pretty good. Like, I don't really like the design of Y. I love the, the design of X. Um, but I'm pretty sure they're both quite similar, but I'm gonna base this one off design. Uh, I much prefer the one from X. Um, yeah, now, now, we, now we get onto the Pokemon that I don't really know. We've got different Lutanas and stuff. We've got different, like, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon stuff. Like, I don't know, they, I know they existed, but I don't know who they are. I don't know anything about them. They can stay and don't know they existed. Let me know if they're good or not in the comments below, please. Palkia, Creation true has to be amazing. I think it's just a dragon water type, which is quite a good type when you think about it. Um, because dragon types typically have the ability to learn quite a few fire moves, at least one. And then obviously that is strong against its water weakness with grass. So I think it's really good. And you got electric and stuff like that, just you can just avoid the electric types. But I think it's a really good Pokemon. And it has the ability to control space. Like <laughs> compared with time. Like that is it's just such a good. God, Pokemon. Fanfy, uh, Fanfy, Fan, uh, like, yeah, terrible. It's not, I, is it a Pokemon? Is it a legendary Pokemon? It's up for debate. It's up for debate. Uh, Raikou can go into okay. Uh, very decent, fair enough Pokemon. It's a decent enough Pokemon. Same sort of story as, uh, Entai. No, Entai's, um, thing is whenever it roars. Whenever it roars, a volcano erupts. And then something along the lines of, like, whenever it. Whenever a volcano erupts, it's another one's born, so like it could contra not contradict, but it could be a get, a get a bit unrealistic. But uh, Raikou, pretty good Pokemon. I remember watching an, an, an old anime uh, thing about Raikou, and it was really good. It was a Pokemon Chronicles, pretty enjoyed it. Uh, but pretty good Pokemon, electric type Pokemon. Uh, Mega Rayquaza and normal Rayquaza, 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 Rayquaza uh, whatever, uh, can both go into amazing. Both fantastic Pokemon. Rayquaza on its own is fantastic, and then the fact they give it an even better version, like what were they doing? And the list of shiny, the black shiny is brilliant. Um, yeah, they can they can stay up in amazing. Um, now we get quite interesting. I quite like the, what we what we got coming up. Actually, looking down here, Reg Ice. I don't want to put terrible because oh, it's okay. It's it's okay. It's okay. Regice is okay, and I think Regigigas. See, now we go. Well, we'll, we'll say Regigigas for last. Regirock Rock and Registeel Steel can all go into okay. I think they could dip into terrible, but I love the story behind them, and I love the noise they make. I I need to play a clip of the noise they make now. <laughs> But the, but itself, like I really like the Pokemon Regigigas. I am torn because Regigigas is such a good Pokemon. I think people forget how good Regigigas is. It's just his ability slow start, which ruins him. And I hate the fact that like Legends Arcus took away all abilities, but his slow start stayed. And I did, and obviously they did that on purpose to stop him being so OP. So I'm gonna put him in okay, just due to the fact. Oh no, but okay, I'm gonna put him in good. And hear me out, hear me out. His story puts him in good. The fact he can move continents is fantastic. It's, it's e, 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 in itself just moves like he moves continents. Um, the story behind him is brilliant. I understand his slow start. I think if he didn't have slow start, he'd be amazing. But the fact that his slow start will put him down pretty good. I know comparatively, he's not good. Reshiram, I quite like Reshiram. Reshiram could go into pretty good. I like the story. I like the, the connecting arc with Zekrom uh, uh, and Kiram. I think he's staying pretty good. Shaman. 
Assume it's normal form. Ooh. Okay. And his sky form could go into pretty good. Um, obviously, it's normal. F I think the thing that's keeping Shaman from not going into terrible is his ability to open up uh, wormholes between the distortion world and the real world. Um, so I think that, that I think, but then his sky form is just really good. Um, I, 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 I do like his sky form. Sweet Coon has to go into, ooh, Sweet Coon is a good Pokemon. I love the story, but I can play him pretty good. He could be touching uh, up here a little bit, but I don't think he's better than Groudon. Um, Sweet Coon, I, I would have to say, like, I really like the story. I, I think a lot of this is just based on what I can think of on the spot. I won't lie to you. I quite like the story of Sweet Coon. Um, he's just, I find him very entertaining. Um, and also, like, he's part of Heart of Gold, Soul Silver. I really like those games. I think I say I need to get past my bias about them. But I think just ultimately, as a Pokemon, he's got this most stunning Pokemon card. I'm gonna get that Pokemon card. Uh, don't know who you guys are. You tap with Finn, yeah, got a Pokemon card of you. Um, but I don't know enough about you to actually warrant putting, like, saying anything stupid about you. Like, I'm saying everything stupid in this video, but, like, like I don't know anything about you to even say something stupid. Because I might say something that's right. Um, I, that, that's not about him. Uh, the, part of the Swords of Justice, anyways. Um, I, 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 yeah, I'm pretty sure you might be quite shit. Um, we'll just forget about you. It's fine. Um, Tornadus? No, that's what it is. Thunderous. 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 Uh, I'm gonna put you in the same one as Tornadus because I don't remember you guys all maybe like, being a different one. I know you got like that other. I got you know. I know you got the other one. But I'm not gonna rank him. I'm gonna put him. I don't even know this name. I'm gonna put it in. Didn't even know it existed. Uh, this one. Um, I'm gonna put it in. Didn't even know it existed. Victini. Victini has to go into amazing. I think just the lore behind Victini is just, it's really good, but I think just, if you, like, read into it, it's meant to be one of the strongest Pokemon ever, and I know in competitive, it's meant to be fantastic, so it has to go into, has to go into there. Uh, Rizian, um, I think Rizian could go in actually okay. Uh, I know Kelio is in here as well, uh, I think, is Kelio in here? Kelio's in here, yeah, he's there. Uh, Rizian's actually pretty decent, and he's coming, and she, or he, she, it looks like a she, is coming into, I could get cancelled for that. It's coming into Scarlet and Violet in the DLC, it's looking like, with Sweet Coon. So, um, Sweet Coon. So, I'm quite looking forward to that. Uh, ooh, ooh, Volcanoarus. Volcanoarus, no. Uh, it's a water fire type. Or is it? Yeah, yeah. Water thunder type, maybe. Water lightning. Lightning type, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna put in the exist. I don't know if enough about it. I know, I know, I know there's a little bit of lore behind it. I know it was meant to be an X and Y, but Z. I don't know enough about it to give an opinion. Uh, Xerneas and Eventil uh, both can go into Amazing. And this is based off their lore and their design. I think the design of both of them are really good. I really like X and Y. But the fact that they can control life and death, like, what? Nothing can control life and death. And these two can. So I think they have to go into Amazing just for that ability alone. Zekrom can join Rash Ram in Pretty good. Um, Zorora. Zorora. Zorora? Saying that wrong. Um, don't know enough about you to give my opinion. Um, Zygarde, 10% is pretty terrible. Uh, Zygarde, 50, or whatever you are. Other, the main Zygarde that everyone knows. It's pretty good. Pretty good. And finally, the final Zygarde, the final Pokemon as well, can go into Amazing. Just because I know it's actually meant to be quite a good Pokemon. Um, and, and I love the final episode of the, the X and Y series as well, when it's like this just coming towards the city and everyone stops. Really good. I love the X and Y series. But no, this is my tier list, and I think it's not terrible. I'm going to get absolutely rinsed in the comments below, potentially, bro. So if you disagree with me, let me know in the comments below. This is my tier list. Um, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. It really helps out. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.